What's up GQ? It's Evan Bodycomb here. I'm just kidding. GQ couldn't afford me, so I'm filming this in my bedroom. But regardless, this is 10 things a gym bro can't live without. I got this bag recently for my birthday. Yes, I'm 20. Happy birthday to me. No, oh, please. Stop. Stop it, guys. This is called the Military Backpack off of Gymshark. But I specifically asked for this bag because it's got so many different compartments. And so far, so good. I really like it. And it's a lot better than my last one. I've got serious beef with my last backpack. This has got five compartments. My sh the old Nike backpack has two. So I would open up this massive compartment and just jam everything in there. And as you can see, since I've got the new backpack, it's not that effective. This is my Yeti drink bottle. It's 32 ounces, which is just over a liter, I believe. I really like this bottle. It's stainless steel, so it can get banged about pretty badly and still comes out victorious. Also, when you take off the lid, it's got this bit that you can actually drink from, so none of that wide, wide bottle bullshit that I've been seeing. These are just some JBL headphones. Uh, they were quite cheap, I think. I had to improvise with some gaffer tape here because they broke on me. That's how you know these have been through the wars, man. I went for a bench PR uh, a year or so ago, one that I had previously hit, and when I went for it, it went up slower than I would have liked. And so I threw my headphones on the ground in a fit of rage. I'm not really sure why I did that, because now they squeak and they broke, but yeah. Don't throw your headphones on the ground. But they still work perfectly fine, they sound great, so. But these are definitely essential, especially at Deramut, because they play the worst music there. I'm kidding, they play like good music. 10% of the time. This is my cologne of choice, Amani Code. My girlfriend got this for me for my birthday. So thank you, baby. And they've got these awesome little sleeves that they can just ooh, slip into. I really love this cologne. It is probably my favorite cologne of all time. I only wear this at the gym if I forgot to bring cologne or if I'm especially stinky and just want to spice it up a little bit. But this, <sighs> I use this deodorant every single day. It's Rexona Clinical Protection. No, I am not sponsored, but this is just a great deodorant. Someone put this on to me a couple years ago and it is the best deodorant I've ever used. It says it lasts up to 96 hours. The only downside is that you got to twist it and it comes through these holes. I don't know if you can see that. It's really weird, but it smells good and it stops me from stinking. So definitely carry deodorant in your gym bag. Don't be that guy that's stinking up the entire gym. I bring a shaker in case I forgot my water bottle or if I forgot to take pre at home. I usually take pre at home just in a glass because yeah, I'm fancy like that. But if I forget to, then I'll take it at the gym with the shaker. And I also have pre-workout in my bag just in case I forget to take it beforehand. I'm currently taking deficit, which is okay. It's more of a fat burner to be honest, but I'm trying to drop my caffeine intake because I don't want to die. It's only got 100 milligrams of caffeine per scoop, but right now that's all I need. Yes, I have a lot of accessories. I've got clips for barbells at the gym because I don't trust Deramut's clips after my accident. Holy shit, mate, you broke both your legs. Are you all right? Someone call me man. <laughs> Anyways, I bring knee sleeves because I've got the knees of an old man and just an assortment of straps. I've got straps for pull days, straps for push days, just in case I'm not feeling it and I want to target that muscle just a little bit more. And yeah, that's pretty much everything in my gym bag. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please do like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, it's linked down below. Share it with your friends. And as always, thank you guys for watching.